Hey everybody, RPG here. Today I'm going to show you guys how to use the missing BIOS file feature on Botticera. So this is a really great feature to have. A lot of emulation platforms don't have this and it eliminates all the running around. So basically what this feature does is it combs through your entire system and it lists for you each of the BIOS files that are missing for each of the collections on Botticera. So for example, if we're jumping into PlayStation and we're getting an error message as soon as we load in the game and it's saying that we're missing BIOS files, we can just go to this missing BIOS file feature on Botticera and it'll give us a detailed list of all the missing BIOS files, their names, and all we have to do then is just track those down, drop them into our file system, and we're good to go. We'll be able to start playing all those games and game collections. So what I'm gonna do for you today is I'm gonna show you exactly how to access this feature so you can figure out exactly what BIOS files you need for all your different collections. So let's get started. All right, so in order to see what BIOS files are missing, we need to first access our main menu. So you can do this with either a keyboard or a gamepad controller. If you're using a keyboard, just hit the space bar. If you're using a gamepad controller, hit your start button. So you can see here I pulled up my main menu. The second option down is game settings. So we're going to select game settings. And then if we go all the way down here, we are going to look for system settings. And then the third option down, it says missing BIOS. So this is gonna be the tool that shows us all the missing BIOS files on the entire Botticera setup here. So if we open this up, you can see that it's gonna be sectioned off by each collection. So as we scroll down, it'll show you every single BIOS file that's missing for each particular collection. So it's really nice to be able to go in here and find exactly which ones you're missing so you don't have to go and do Google searches or figure out exactly what's required and then figure out which ones you have, and which ones you don't have. This is a really awesome tool that I think really is, um, you know, something special for Botticera because a lot of other emulation platforms don't have this uh, available. So uh, it's really a great tool. Now I have a whole bunch missing because I actually just removed literally every BIOS file on my entire Botticera. Um, just to do a separate video where I'm going to show you guys exactly how to drop all your BIOS files in in one shot. So uh, I'll put a link in the description of this video so you guys can check that out. But just continuing to scroll down here, you can see, again, each collection that requires BIOS files is going to show which ones are missing. Now, if I had some in there, then they would not be populated into this missing BIOS file list. So let's say that I went and added Sega Dreamcast, and that was the only collection that I added BIOS files for, then that wouldn't be populating into this list. It is just because I don't have any BIOS files for Sega Dreamcast currently, but if I did go and add them, then they would no longer populate into this missing BIOS files list. So um, this is also a great tool because it enables you the um, ability to test and make sure that your BIOS files are inserted in there properly as well. So if I went and dropped um, the uh, Neo Geo BIOS file, for example, I went and dropped it in, maybe I put it in the wrong place. If I put it in the wrong place, then it would still be populating here on this missing BIOS files list. So it's kind of a great tool to go in and uh, troubleshoot and also verify whether it was everything was added in correctly as well. So uh, really, think that this is a great tool to utilize here when you're setting up Botticera for the first time. So continuing down, you can see PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, um, original PlayStation has a whole bunch, and so on. There's just a bunch for pretty much every collection on here. I can't say that every single collection has them. I don't think that Nintendo Entertainment System or Super Nintendo has any BIOS files, um, but the majority of the collections here do, and as you can see from Amiga here specifically, this one has an absolute ton of BIOS files that are required. So um, that's pretty much it in terms of how to access all your missing BIOS files here on Botticera. All right, so as you can see from this video, this is a really great feature to have on an emulation platform. I think it's definitely a home run for Botticera that they've you know, put this into their system. Um, and it definitely eliminates all the running around that we have to do. We still have to obviously track down those BIOS files, but now we have the exact name uh, and the exact one that we're missing for each of these collections. So it definitely is really easy. Now I do have for you guys a direct link, which I'll put in the description below, that'll give you access to just about all of the major BIOS files that you need for Botticera. So what's really great about this, it's a one drop uh, sort of situation. So we just download and unzip this particular file. It'll give you all of the BIOS files in one shot. 
and we don't have to go and start piecing things together and doing Google searches and trying to track down all these individual BIOS files. It all comes together on one zipped file. All we have to do is unzip it and simply copy and paste it right into our BIOS files on Botticera. So I have a separate video to show you exactly how to install all these BIOS files. So I'll put a link to that as well in the description below. But hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you did, smash the like button for me. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel here. We do a whole bunch of different videos based around retro gaming, uh, including Botticera and RetroPie specifically. So definitely a lot of great stuff to find on here. A lot of great tutorials, uh, product reviews, gameplay demos. So definitely hit the subscribe button. And of course, check us out online on our website, www.retropieguy.com. Thanks for watching today.